I'm just thinking with my dick. Hey Bailey, um, it's Sadie. Sorry, I know this is really last minute, but you want to go to fucking Coachella next week? I just genuinely cannot believe that I'm stuck in this airport right now. Is that my bestie in a tessie? Hey guys. Oh, <laughs> first day here. <laughs> I feel like What's up guys? Um, I'm with Sadie. What's up fuckers? That's Sadie. Basically, if you watched my last video, you would know that I was stuck in the airport for like 24 hours and it was like the worst experience of my life. But we made it to Palm Springs. <laughs> yeah, we were supposed to get into the Revolve Festival yesterday, but when we showed up, it was so late. Basically, we didn't get in and we spent the night with the members of Too Hot to Handle. When we were standing at the fucking desert event shit, I saw one of my friends or two people that I've known from LA, which is so shocking because I know Nobody. We went with them back to their Airbnb. Today is gonna be a better day. Um, I just canceled my flight, I guess. So we're staying an extra day. Oh, she did you rebook a question mark? No, not yet. But yeah, I'll insert some of the footage that I got yesterday. It's not gonna be great, but we're starting fresh today. We so. are. Um, this is a shit show. It is a shit show. Enjoy. <laughs> you in the car trying to talk and you just keep laughing. I like, couldn't do it. Oh shit. I haven't started yet. Oh, this is Sandy. This is so hey, bad. Yeah, so am I. We fucking suck at our job. That's a good name. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what the fuck to wear. Okay, I literally haven't said anything to you guys yet, but this is the outfit for, um... I don't know where we're going. I got my head out this sunroof. I'm blasting my favorite tunes. I only got... <laughs> Hell yeah, right? Fuck that shit up. I mean, you know, in San Francisco, there's... There's no good, uh... Strip clubs, but in New York. No, 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 I'm in GTA. Oh, oh, oh I am sorry. Oh, I am shy now. <laughs> You're <laughs> totally fine. fine. You're fine. Because <laughs> in GTA, I always go to the strip club. Uh, Mervana Sosun. Miss Sosun? Oh. Uh, not Miss it's like muscle, muscle. Sun. Okay, so current situation, I haven't vlogged anything, but apparently we can't get in. Apparently they're not letting people in to the event. Get over Harry Josie's legs. Okay, wait, guys. Quick hotel tour. <laughs> oh yeah, this fucking shit show we have going on right now. It's so cute. It's so modern. It yes. screams Vegas. Okay, I feel like we're in Vegas. Yeah, wait till you guys see these fucking pictures on the wall. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh my god, I look so scary. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going food and um, this lady is yelling at us telling us we need to like give them breakfast tickets but we don't have breakfast tickets so we're just gonna eat dude you should have seen my pimple patches that I ripped off this morning oh did it work uh-huh it was oh, so yeah. juicy okay. not this again I know literally I'm, I feel like, like I'm getting deja vu we literally are in the same exact outfit we both are like <laughs> they're probably getting deja vu like what the fuck we're no like, we're just Disgusting and <laughs> no, literally. I love that we both put on the same outfit. I, I have, have so, so much shit in my back. You need to give me like a makeup tutorial. I'm gonna go watch like one of your makeup tutorials. Yes. <laughs> but as you can tell by the title, I'm doing a sixth and seventh grade makeup tutorial look. Wait, what is that? Anti pollution sunshine drops, but I just got them. I'm so fucking out of it. Like, I'm literally looking in here and I'm like, <laughs> like yesterday felt so not real like that's what i think it was like we're across the country we're in some area that looks like a fucking gta 5 map there's so many people running around in like their little weird outfits <laughs> and i'm just like we're in an alternative universe or whatever the fuck that thing's called the twilight zone alternative <laughs> So I know I like explained like we couldn't get in, but I didn't explain like what that meant. So basically Sadie got invited by Revolve to come and like Lord knows why. I'm like her plus one. So we were supposed to get into the event and she was supposed to like post like an Instagram story or some shit. Basically, 
they over invited like the whole population of like the United States of America I think and we were under the impression not like saying like oh yeah like <laughs> we deserve the invite <laughs> what she's saying is right it's like we weren't being like oh it's only influencers like what but like I've seen this shit go on for like two or three years now and like when they said that we could go I was like what so we like ubered there and we got like dropped off at this random corner and then we were trying to figure out like where we needed to go so this like random dude like came up to us and was like I know the CEO like I can get you guys in we were like we don't really need help getting in like, we just need to know where to go because like we had like our emails and shit to get wristbands so then we were like walking to like the front entrance or whatever and there was like huge groups of people like walking back saying that they weren't letting anybody else in because like of max capacity or like the security was like freaking out so then we ended up walking like six miles no it was probably like two miles two or three so we walk and we walk like four blocks to this like bus shuttle pickup like in a random parking lot that we were like originally supposed to go to Coachella. basically it was a show and like hundreds and hundreds of people were in the same position as us and like nobody could get in. Harry Jowsey couldn't even get in and he was an ass. We're hoping that today we have better luck and we're getting there a lot earlier so hopefully we can get in and see Jack Harlow. That's really all I care about. Yeah hopefully we can just get in. Otherwise we just dropped so much money to be here just to like f around in this scary hotel. <laughs> okay we just went outside and took some pictures. Hi vlog. Um, we're currently trying to jump on this. <laughs> Is it thin? Hold on wait let me get you. literally doing nothing i'm like son woo okay, I'm just okay. <laughs> and now we're back and i just put on like the dress that i'm gonna wear it's from princess polly and my shoes are just my converse we're ordering the uber now it's currently like 12 a little after 12 so we're earlier than yesterday so hopefully we can get in <gasps> la 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 i jumped down with like brakes Hold up guys, I know you just want to continue watching this video, but over 50% of you watching right now aren't subscribed. What are you doing? Click that subscribe button and also check out Sadie's video when you're done watching this. Wow, you've been going. Yeah, I would be dead. Uh, wow. Oh really? Yeah. Wow, that's crazy. Wow. Better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. I don't know what I was expecting honestly, but like not this and I feel like I'm never ever Okay, it's been a few hours since I talked to you guys last but we keep coming back to this chicken truck It's like plant-based chicken, but it's so good and I actually can't stop eating it New favorite chicken alternative, you can find a whole goose brown Coachella, this is the fucking party. I'm drunk. I lost my shirt. This is fucked up, but I love it. We're walking over to the stage now to see if Jack Harlow is actually gonna perform or if it's just not even gonna happen. Do you guys wanna be in my vlog? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna, that's gonna be $5,000. What do you say? Uh, you wanna be in my vlog? Sure. Hi, vlog. Okay, okay, okay. I got one. 
question. Maybe we should just do the Grammy nominated biggest song of last year. Let's just see how it goes. Come on. Well, I think that about does it. I think, that's, I think I'm all right. We did just drop some shit. I'm gonna just come clean. I'm a little nervous. I haven't really had a chance to perform this yet. I'm on English Club now. I got another damn. That's right, that's right. Excuse me, can I ask a favor? Could you possibly come on this side and take a picture of us in the truck? I love the wide angle, that is so sick. You could like <clears throat> put it on there. Get one of those mm -hmm. for that, yeah. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna recap everything in this food. I think that honestly, we should just explain what, oh, I'm getting a call. Hello? Yes, hi, it's Haiti. Hi, how are you? This is Eric from New Ball. The 16th, it was supposed to be back? I got it on the 16th. Yeah, I was supposed to be back at the end of the day, but that's okay, I can extend it. Oh, okay, this shit is hard to vlog. Because we suck at what we do. <laughs> Basically, the first day we got here, we went to Revolve. I think we we kind of explained it. We just, it was a show. Apparently, we can't get in. The first day, because we didn't know what time we were supposed to get there. We got there late. We had to walk like four miles. We're going to recap yesterday for you guys. So, it's now Monday. They're like, why are they still there? We yeah. changed our fight. Flight. Fight. <laughs> Fucking damn it. We changed our flight. Yesterday morning, me and Bailey woke up, went downstairs, got breakfast, changed our flight. Because we were supposed to leave this morning so early. We were going to have to definitely stay up all night yesterday. Go to the airport at like 3 a.m. We were just like, f*** that. We're staying an extra day. We woke up. We're so f***ing delusional. Immediately, we're getting ready. We thought for some reason it would be a good idea to take our U-Haul truck to the parking lot of Coachella. And then we decided last minute we weren't going to do that. Got ready, went outside, got in our Uber. Our Uber driver was super cool. He loved weed. Um, And then we got to the festival parking lot. And it's like this big parking lot. It's like sand, desert, dunes. No, there's no dunes. So we got like into the festival around like two, I think. And we wanted to get there early and we got in and nobody was there. It was so dead. And we it were was. like, what is going on? We're really just like, what's going on? Like, what are we supposed to do? And we were under the impression we have to get here early or else we're not gonna fucking get in. Well, we got there so fucking early that we were like, holy shit, we're now gonna have to wait till like 8 p.m. for anyone to even come on and sing. Keep in mind, it's like 100 fucking degrees. It was just random. I feel like we just did random fucking shit. We like shit walked after around that. like the entire premises like mm -hmm. six different times. We <laughs> picked up a random fucking chicken nugget. Like, <laughs> we were sitting on a bitch. On a bitch. <laughs> but she picks up this fucking chicken nugget and we're sitting on this bench and we both just take a bite out of it. Like we're both just like, yeah, I just probably been there since like yesterday baking in the sun. It wasn't Dying even bad time. though. Anyone I was seeing that I know damn well doesn't know me, I was like, oh my like Blake Gray. But I saw like Blake Gray and I'm like, Blake! Hey, how are you? Good to see you again. And I know he's like, you literally like I don't was so confused. He was like hi yeah how are you it was getting towards like the end of the night when jack harlow was going to come on so everyone was going to the stage and earlier me and bailey were sitting down and my fucking favorite thing to say yesterday to everyone was hey how are y'all happy easter god bless and then shake their hand literally <laughs> fucking everyone was i was doing, doing that too and we're sitting down in the grass like literally napping there's this guy taking pictures of girls i'm like you want a picture of us he takes a picture of us and we literally are like if I find that picture, I will literally pee myself. Then some other dude walked up, who I swear I've seen before. He's just like one of those dudes you can tell is like in management and shit. Mm -hmm. He walks up and I'm like, hey, how are you? And he kind of turned around and he was like, wait, do I know you? And he like made it an effort to like talk to us. And then he just like whips out these wristbands from his pocket. And he's like, these are VIP. Come find us like up at the booth, which we had been trying to get into like all literally. day. Like, how do we get up there? Like, how do we get up there? Because it was just like chairs and chill. We got the wristbands. Jack Carlo was coming on. We went up there and then we realized we wanted to be in the mosh pit anyways, which wasn't a mosh pit. But let's just call it that. But we get down, like, really pretty close to the stage. He came on. He was good. I mean, yeah. you could tell he didn't want to be there. But you could just tell everyone performing there didn't want to be there. And you were wanted to f*** her. He did. I saw that smile he gave you. <laughs> Bailey was, like, fixing her dress and he looked over. Like, smiled. And Bailey was like... She was like, oh, fuck. I'm like, okay, I'm like, did he just look over? <laughs> Jack Harlow wants everybody to... Wants to f*** 
him. Like, he wants everyone to be like, Dad. Because he said, he was like, you know, I try and, like, look for people, like, in here. I always want to make a connection with one person in the audience. And every girl's, like, staring to make the eye contact. Uh, like, he was, like, name three of my songs. I would have been, like, first class. I don't know. Any, what's a different one? What's the one with Lil Nas? Industry, baby. <laughs> How does that one go? <laughs> Industry baby, yeah. <laughs> I hope he sees this video. <laughs> Not like that. Then we left. I felt like we were in a war zone when we left. It was so bad. I thought they were gonna start like, shooting. I thought they were gonna start shooting. People were getting worried. People were like, not nah, like everyone. rubber bullets. Like I thought, uh, like, like not like yeah, blow like blowout. Like, there was like military men with like dogs running around. I'm like, whoa, this is it fucking Rafal festival. Like, oh my god, I forgot about little Huddy. Oh my god, little Huddy, of course. I saw a little huddle. Little. <laughs> he wanted to. Kill me. We leave. We bump into <laughs> Marvin, who has a bottle of tequila down his <laughs> pants. And he stole. Yeah, he definitely <laughs> stole that. <laughs> he grabs our hands, brings us on the bus. We go on the bus with him. He wanted McDonald's so bad, which he was also talking about the night before. We get in an Uber, go to McDonald's. We're sitting on the curb eating our McDonald's. Right Currently, I'm in total. He doesn't have a shirt on. We can get 40 pieces of Mike chicken, bro. Mike chicken. I like the whatever it is. Like mustard? You want sweet and sour? Sweet and sour is good. No, you know I what? I'm not gonna lie. When I first met you, I was like, just, <laughs> first. like last night you yesterday. Oh, yeah. You do yeah, not oh, remember yeah. that shit. You were talking about McDonald's. Oh, for real? Yes, you did. <laughs> and then I found out who you were today, and then I saw you again. And then when I started talking to you, I was like, he's just trying to fuck a bitch. Like he just really wants to fuck a bitch. Yeah. And now that I talk to you, <laughs> yeah, right. I try to make me look good. We're gonna no, yeah, <laughs> then you're gonna... Bro, come pick me up, bro. I'll you see. want us to drive you? We don't have <laughs> Okay, we got back. Got our McDonald's. You brought Marvin back. If Jack Harlow would have hopped off it. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Like I'm just trying to get a water. Is smart water good? You fuck with that? <laughs> but no. Moral of the story, Jack Harlow's low-key fake. <laughs> he acted like he didn't know who we were. <laughs> we came back here oh. and we were dead at this point. I got, I don't know what the f*** is going on, but I was having to puke and use the number two or go number two so badly. I'm sitting here, she's like, sh <laughs> dying. I'm just sitting here like on my phone whatever and I remember seeing earlier I got like a find my iPhone like notification so I like go back and I'm like okay find my iPhone like what is this and it literally says an air tag detected near you I would have freaked out if I, was I literally saw that and I saw like it was with us and I saw it like came from somewhere far and I was like oh my god I started like shaking and and I was like, oh my god, like I see this on TikTok all the time about like sex traffickers and like people trying to like get girls and shit. I was like Sadie and then I like went over and I was like looking through all of our bags and shit and I was like somebody is gonna fucking like show up here Because literally people can like drop air tags just like in, in your purse fucking, like, And I had my little car. tote bag on me all night open like I called um Christian that I know that we kept bumping into yeah and I just told him about it and he was like, we're gonna come to like your hotel and just like check on you guys and whatever. So they came here, come to the room. They're first of all, like this is the creepiest fucking hotel They're ever. like distraught over how scared they are of this hotel. And, and like, it's so funny too, because Marvin came in here because I was giving him a t-shirt. Someone <laughs> stole his shirt, which we don't it's fucking know. It's like $400 Yeah, shirt. literally, we have no idea how that happened. So I gave him one of my t-shirts and even he came in here and he was like, this hotel creepy, bro. Like, we were like, yeah. guys, it's not that bad. Yeah, like, we were like, no, we're not worried they're about like, it. just wait. Yeah. Wait till we tell you what we oh, just yeah. saw. They're like, holy fuck, the creepiest thing just happened. And what they what they even say? What did they say at first? They so, literally like, just said, like, the girl from The Shining is standing on the yeah, third yeah, yeah, floor. Yeah. And we were all like... No, and Chelsea was so good at impersonating it. They actually went to the third floor, and we were on the second. And they were walking up there, and that they turned, like, a corner or something. And there was literally just, like, a girl with, like, black long hair standing there, like... Like horror movie shit. So then Christian and Anna, who were down here with us, were like, we want to go see it. So they went upstairs to go see it. And the other three were just standing in here, like just talking to us, making us feel more comfortable or whatever. Then fucking, we hear Christian and like sprinting down the hallway and like trying to open the door. And we're through like banging. We are literally so to it. Like everyone else is kind of like, what's going on? And we're literally like, 
like, how's your diary? <laughs> We're literally just like chilling. They come in. Christian's face is white. Literally fucking white as a ghost. And he's like, bro, bro. Oh my God, bro. Like he's fucking freaking the fuck out. Everyone else is like, what happened? He's like, literally I was upstairs and we were looking for it. And he goes, and we're just kind of looking around. And I turn the corner and she's right here. <laughs> which is fucking terrifying actually. I wouldn't so cry. Christian was so scared. Like he was like, bro, I literally no, I like, feel bad, but I almost punched that bitch. Like I didn't know what to do. Her. He was like pacing and he came and sat down. And he was like, Sadie, Sadie, I'm not kidding. They were like bad begging us to come back with them. You can have our like room, like just like, don't stay here. They were so scared and like we were like, like, no, like we're, we're probably good. He's like, all I can say is if I was in this hotel and I saw that, I would have checked out. But we fucking went back up there with him to try and find her and we didn't, but it's really funny. Okay, okay all right, okay. let's go up there. Yeah. I'm going great, okay? We're gonna go up there and then we're gonna pack our shit and leave. This doesn't seem very brand friendly. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Yo, she had my air tag. I don't know how she got it. Wait, what if she's the air tag? Shut the fuck up. Okay, Shut no, the fuck up. I'll give you like 20 pop tags if you get her to say what's up for her. Do you guys want to go? I feel like you should say I, like this is a group I don't, don't want to see it. Time. We're going ghost hunting. Yo, there is dirt in my lungs. I don't care. She's already Really? Really? I'm going to try. Passed out. Last night. We passed out. Okay, sorry guys, my camera just died, but we're back. What, what were we saying? Oh, we passed out. Oh yeah, we pass out. Ten minutes after they leave, Sadie's like, I was dead. dead. I was so. And tired. I'm just like sitting on my phone. I was like looking through pictures from earlier in the day, and I was like, you know, maybe I should go to bed too. So I like put my phone down. You know, like the second you start like dozing off, but you're like asleep but not fully asleep. I, I hear Sadie like rolling around. She's like. Did we pass out? Like, did we fall asleep? I was like, what do you mean? Like, are we not surprised? I actually, like, but I wasn't scared at all last night. Like, the air tag, and there's a creepy bitch in our hotel, and there's someone sleeping downstairs on the couch. <laughs> I literally just, like, I never wanted to go to bed more. Like, I, I feel was so good. Yeah. Why do I do this? <laughs> I literally will stand and like... Okay, you guys, current situation. If you remember our little update. Oh, wait, is that going? Yeah, I'll just put this after. It makes sense. If you remember our little update um, from earlier about the air tag and how it was like detected by us, we thought our problem was gone because it was no longer being detected by us. It just popped up again, and we're, we're more than. We're more than positive that it's in the car because the like tracker on it tracks like everywhere that our car has been. One of the kids that we were with had an air tag. So we're praying that it's just in the car and he left it in there on accident, which is weird, but like I think maybe he just like forgot. But the problem is we have to bring back the fucking U-Haul truck and come back here. And then of course the fucking air tag keeps going off when it's pitch just, black. Just just nighttime. It didn't go off all day, but just at nighttime. I've got my pepper spray though. We're we're ready. Like, do you guys understand now why we're like scared? Like look. Like I'm scared to like make turns. This makes me sick to my stomach. I'm shaking. Okay, items detected with you. We're trying to find it right now. So we pulled to the front of the building where it's like bright. So there's people that are watching us at least. Not readable. Should we check the back? Right by. Wait, that car pulled up right by. And now they're circling. Around. Wait, okay, wait. They just dropped someone off. They'll just circle back. Wait, I hear it. Do you hear that? It's literally over here. It's like here, like hey, in the door. Dude, what? Should I call the U-Haul guy maybe? Hello? Hey, is this the U-Haul? U-Haul? I have a question. Yeah. Do you have air tags in your cars? Yes, we do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We've been freaking <laughs> out. Someone no, put one in here. It's been beeping in your, in your phone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this whole time? So, coast is clear. <laughs> We're gonna go buy tampons. Yeah. This is the world we live in today. Do you use Summer's Eve at all? No, I heard that shit's bad for you. Fucks up your it, yeah. pH balance. Yeah, same. But I'm like, yeah, me too. <laughs> what if I said, yeah? No, I was really thinking that. I would have been like, oh. yeah, I love that shit. I'd have been like, oh, really? Cool. Do you like it? I don't. <laughs> See, lately I've been getting these, but I fucking hate them. I also got these, but then I watched a girl get toxic shock syndrome. Oh, really? Yeah. Tampa. 
Oh, someone just say my name. Hi. Do you guys take Apple Pay? I love your nose stud. Oh, thank you. Of course. Seven dollars for a box of 14 tampons. <laughs> It's 4 a.m. and Sadie missed her flight. We knew it was gonna happen. We literally just tried to get an Uber. Didn't work. Didn't work. Lyft. Didn't work. There was. We could take some pretty sunrise pictures. We were not expecting it to be busy. I was like, no, like it's so early in the morning. Like Palm Springs is a small airport, guys. Look at this. The line goes to the door. Like that's just to check in. And then the security. So small. Emo girl. At least the mountains look pretty over there. Yo, Harry! Harry! <laughs> that's, that's all fake. Those are fake. All of these people are fake. I just ordered anything that looked like food, okay? I don't want all of that. Why am I cry? I'm not even, like I can still see her foot and I have separation anxiety. Oh, I actually wanna cry, what the fuck? <laughs> 